I have faith that the Constitution will be saved as prophesied by Joseph Smith. But it will not be saved in Washington. It will be saved by citizens of this nation who love and cherish freedom. It will be saved by enlightened members of this church, men and women, who will subscribe to it and abide the principles of the Constitution. I revere the Constitution of the United States as a sacred document. To me, the words are akin to the revelations of God, for God has placed his stamp of approval on the Constitution of this land. I testify that the God of heaven sent some of his choicest spirits to lay the foundation of this government, and he has sent other choice spirits, even you who hear my words this day, to preserve it. We, the blessed beneficiaries, face difficult days in this beloved land, a land which is choice above all other lands. It may also cost us blood before we are through. It is my conviction, however, that when the Lord comes, the stars and stripes will be floating on the breeze over this people. May it be so. And may God give us the faith and the courage exhibited by those patriots who pledge their lives and fortunes that we might be free. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen.